As we eagerly await all of the Panini football products that have been pushed back over the last few weeks, we are going to open a different type of football. We're going to be uh, getting into a 2023-24 Select EPL Hobby Box today. Let's get into it. Hey everyone, what's going on? It's Andy with Acme Packs and I welcome each and every one of you back for a new video. Today we are taking a look at the new 2023-24 Select EPL Hobby Box. This is coming in at about $250. Um, they were a little high, then they dropped. I'm seeing them most, mostly around $250 now. So this is the third iteration of, the, um, of Select this year when you had, um, you had Serie A and... Um, uh, La Liga coming out as well and in my opinion this is the worst of the three so far not because of the league but because of the print run um I, I myself personally love the EPL the most but there are better chase rookies in say La Liga and much shorter print runs for both La Liga and Serie A than there are for EPL but it's to be expected because EPL is arguably the most popular league um, for soccer right now. So again, $250 a box. You will pay more for the other stuff, but $250 a box for this really isn't that bad in my opinion. You can still hit big. There are some good chase rookies in here and some up and coming guys as well that um, kind of showed out at the Euros a little bit, got some minutes. Um, you got five cards per pack, 12 packs per box, find three autographs or memorabilia cards per box on average. Most times it's going to be one auto, two mems, just so you guys are aware. And then you have um, ultra rare inserts, including stained glass, artistic impressions, and visionary, um, and more as well. So then these are the checklists on the back, I believe five numbered cards per box. And then you have the standard select soccer um, tiers. So you have the Terrace, Premier, Mezzanine, uh, mezzanine and field level so the field level is going to be your rarest and that is only a 50 base set 50 card base set but if you can see up here 175 down to one um is going to be your numbering i believe in la liga i correct me if i'm wrong here i think it was 75 was the highest that you could go um so almost double uh the print run on this but you know let's see if we can get something good out of here today i'm a huge fan of the EPL. Um, unfortunately, my team is Manchester United. They've had a rough go of it the last few years. You know, definitely some inconsistencies. Um, I'm sure a lot of people love to hear that because I know Man, Man U and Man City are, you know, considered the most unlikable teams <laughs> in the EPL, even though there are tons of fans for both of them. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Show you guys what you can expect if you guys are looking to get into one of these yourselves. Personally, I absolutely love Rip and Select no matter what the sport is, and I do love my soccer products. I do think Panini does a very, very good job with their soccer. Had to check there because I missed a pack in my La Liga box. Didn't hit anything good, but missed a pack for the video. Um, but yeah, let's see what we have. And if you guys enjoy the soccer rips, the soccer reviews, be sure to let me know down in the comments. Remember to like and subscribe really helps me out and keeps the channel going we got a thicky here uh probably a f looks like a filler all right we got a blue these are non-numbered i believe and that is going to be um willy kambuala Kamb now i am not a um expert in soccer but that is man U, so i like that one for my pc there um that is going to be ooh, long size sleeve is this better I mixed up my two sleeves by accident. Uh, that is the Terrace level. That is the Terrace level. And then Jared Bo uh, Bowen. So ceiling for this product, probably one of the Chase rookies uh, in like a one of one with Miley, um, Adingra, uh, Wharton, maybe Oscar Bob, all having um, solid footholds this season. We got a really thick one here. So this could be a patch auto or just a patch. And I think the normal autos are pretty thick as well. They were in La Liga. So um, I think we got a field level on the back too. Field level purple. Let's, uh, hey, there's Erling Holland. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, Mudrick. We'll take it. Mikhail Mudrick. Uh, 125 out of 149. Chelsea field level on the purple. Cool. 
He is uh, he was a rookie last year, so not too shabby. All right, and let's see what we have here. Looks like it's I don't know what this is. Muhammad Salah. We will. Oh, and Darwin Nunez. So I was hoping this would be a dual auto. That would be so sick. Um, it's gonna, just going to be a dual relic, but it is not from any specific game or event. Still pretty cool. Still pretty cool. Um, you know, people will call me a hypocrite here. I, I'm a huge fan of, you know, multiple different teams, mostly Manchester United. I do like Liverpool. I do like Chelsea. I mean, I'm not committed to any one team. I just like seeing uh, good soccer be, be played. Um, Steven Gerrard really made me love Liverpool. He was one of my favorite players, just like Wayne Rooney. Um, loved watching those guys. Uh, Marcus Rashford, Ashford, who had a not-so-great season on the mezzanine there. Um, Jacob Brun Larson on the silver. And then we got a camo coming up. Oh, we got two camos. Interesting. First one is going to be Sally March. And Ruben Diaz for Man, Man City out of 175. So that is going to be your highest print run. I'm wondering if we got an extra there because I don't believe <laughs> you're supposed to have two numbered cards per box. 92 out of 175 there, or two numbered cards per pack. All right. But EPL can be rough. Like I said, higher print run than um, the other products, but you can still hit big. Uh, João Pedro for Brighton. And then we got an equalizers of uh, Casado, Moises Casado. Cool, on the silver there. All right. Got another thick one. Nope, it's just gonna be a um, filler. And uh, Nicholas Dominguez for Nottingham Forest. It's a cool looking parallel. That might be the tricolor, is what that's called. So, not too bad there. And then we got a silver uh, Mituma for Brighton and Hove Albion. About halfway through the box. Once again, I think Panini's done a fantastic job with soccer. I really do. Um, I think that they have really carved out a nice. Niche. Some of their products, in my opinion, are very expensive. Uh, Zarbarn, Zarbarnwi? I'm probably butchering, butchering that like crazy. Uh, for Burnamouth. And a Future of Mengi. Silver Mezzanine there, though. I think that's the Mezzanine. Yeah. Um, I always find very a, a lot of value in Panini Soccer. Um, very, very rarely... Have I gotten smoked on this stuff? It could be different for other people, but just in my experience... Hey, there we go. Adam Wharton. On the rookie for Crystal Palace. Not too bad there. And then... Hey, hey there we go. Erling Holland on what looks to be the tricolor. Mezzanine. Cool. Wish that was numbered. Nice looking card, though. Unfortunately, did not make the Euro... We got another purple coming up. Got Kwanzaa on the rookie. Silver, Lakonga. And purple, Bakoyo Saka. Take it on the mezzanine. That is numbered to 149. So, like I said, a lot of really, really high numbered cards in this product, uh, which is going to hurt the value, in my opinion, making this, like I said, the roughest of the products for select so far. FIFA is always very, very good, though. Um... Ooh, we got tie-dye coming up. Tie-dye mezzanine coming up. Uh, Jean Duran. We got Jordan Ayu. Been around for a long time. All right. To 10. Oh, we got go gold here. Gold to 10. Come on. West Ham. Tony. Uh, Cotty? That is an auto. All right. Let's, uh, let's see what's behind it first. It's a tie-dye. It's going to be James Madison for Tottenham. That's pretty cool. Um, that's going to be our auto, though. Legend. Tony Cotty for West Ham. And it is gold. Not going to be upset about that. All right. 
My sleeves are all messed up right now. I'll take it. Sorry if my hands seem a little jittery today. I am living on coffee this morning. Did not sleep well last night. But Gold Auto, Tony Cotty. Not too shabby. And then a James Madison. And the tie-dyes, I believe, are to 49 in this product. Yeah, 45 out of 49 on the mezzanine. I love the mezzanine this year. For all select products, I thought selected a fantastic... Or a Panini adding that mezzanine for a lot of the products. Just looks like a really, really, really good design. All right, so this is probably a mem here, I would assume, uh, just the way that... Um, just the way that these boxes go. I would be shocked if this was an auto. Maybe it is an auto. Or, or maybe S stands for swatches. <laughs> it's going to be Harvey Barnes. Oh no, it is an auto. We'll take it. 23 out of 49. Harvey Barnes. We will take it. And then a Raul Jimenez on the pink. And that is to 99. So this was this has been a very solid box. A lot of numbered cards in this one. Got two autos. One of them was gold. One of them was numbered to 49. Can't complain too much about this box at all. Um, will all boxes be this good? Probably not. This is definitely going to be a filler coming up. Unless we somehow panini panini. Uh, nope. Ooh, that looks different. Um, got Tomoyasu. And then a silver field level of Sobelsai. Nice looking card for Liverpool. And it's going to be a select stars of Antony. I thought that was gold for a second, the way that it was like shining. But it is not. He is probably on the move. No, or, or he already got moved. <laughs> like I said, I try to keep up with all the soccer leagues. I... I struggle. <laughs> I do struggle, but I am a fan. All right, and we're going to end it off with a red and a silver. Um, unfortunately, did not hit any of the big rookies that you're looking for. Um, Tom Lockyer for uh, Luton Town is a rookie. It is a color match. We'll take it. And then Martin Odegaard on the silver. So overall, pretty solid box. Reds are non-numbered. Pretty solid box. We did get two autos and, and one mem. Um, both autos were pretty decent. Um, and then the mem was also very good. Uh, Harvey Barnes was to 49. We got Raul Jimenez on the pink to 99. James Madison, it's awesome, to 49 on the tie-dye. Got a Tony Cotty on the gold auto, West Ham legend. Uh, Bukayo Saka on the purple, to, uh, 49. Erling Holland, that's awesome, on the mezzanine. Um, tricolor, I believe is what that is, or purple and white. Um, we got Zabarni, uh, Dominguez, Camo of March, Diaz, and then a Mem of Sala and Darwin Nunez. And then a uh, Mikhail Mudrik uh, to 149 on the field level. So definitely a pretty good box. Will all boxes be this good? I would say no. Um, I feel like we got quite a lot in here. I mean, we got one, two, um, our, both of our autos were numbered three, four, five. We got six numbered cards. You're only supposed to get five. So one of those packs did have an extra numbered card in it. So we did get luck out. Um, unfortunately, again, we did not hit any of the chase rookies, but I feel like we made up for it in quantity and low numbered autos. So that is going to do it for this one. Let me know what you guys think of this product down in the comments. Remember to like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.